In this lesson, I want us to take a look at setting up categories. Now, I just want to mention that categories are optional, but they're also great if you, you know, if you're going to have, you know, a lot of different plans that you want to categorize each one into a specific, you know, group, then this is where categories are really excellent because it allows you to put, you know, certain people into certain um, categories so you can be able to manage that better. So to do that, once you go to the category section and you click on new, you have the title. And then you can put in this category one. You can put in whatever description there. And then here you can also set the access level, which we're going to take a look at a little bit later. But you can set the access level here. Who do you want to be able to access this particular category? So if you have a specific category that you want just for certain groups of members to access, you can create a category for them here and only the people in this specific category are going to access you know that particular item and this is usually helpful because if you have some content that you want to share but you don't want for the general public to see you want just for certain members based on their membership types to choose from then you can set that here so for now i'm just going to leave this at public and we're going to take a look at when we're restricting content later and you want to make sure that the publish this one is set to yes uh, then you just click save and close